Hey guys, welcome back to Arsa Girl Plays. Today I am in Seaboard City once again because look what happened. We got a very, very exclusive neighborhood, Seaboard Hills. Oh my gosh, this is where the mansions go to live. And I had a real heck of a time trying to find it when looking at the normal house lots because it's hard to tell that these are the lots up here. So I wanted to show you guys so you knew how to find them and you didn't have to drive all the way up into the mountains to find it the way I did. I'm gonna go ahead and jump in my car and we're gonna take a drive up into a Seaboard Hills and check out the new lots. And maybe place a new mansion. Let's find out. Uh, can I get in? Thank you. Oh my gosh, look at this. It's so exclusive. How many lots are there? There's two lots. Look at this driveway. Oh my gosh. Wait a minute, hold on. Hashtag Heather can't drive. We know how this goes. But I'm not doing too bad today. I haven't wrecked yet, so there's that. Oops, I might have spoken too soon. Okay, so they're like two identical lots. We've got the mountains behind us. Let's go ahead and grab a lot. I'm dialing up Shark Fin Real Estate. Hello, I'd like to purchase a mansion lot, please. Yes. There is a new mansion and that is this one right here. Now this, you do have to have the celebrity pass in order to play in this mansion, but I wanted to place it in this lot so that we can do a little tour and take a look at it. And then maybe you guys might want to buy the celebrity pass, but if not, you can always come visit me in Seaboard City and play in the house with me sometimes. So, okay, so you drive in here and you've got a covered carport. Let's go around the back and check this place out. I like their hedges. Ooh, okay, so this is the backyard. One of the things that's really kind of cool about uh, the houses in Seaboard City, which I really love, is you have this green space back here in some of them. I haven't explored all the houses, so I'm not sure if it's in every lot. I don't think it is. I think it's only in some lots. The area back here is actually customizable. So if you come to the extra button, which is this little smiley face here, you'll see it says enable pool, enable trampoline, tennis, Enable basketball, enable garden. These are all things that can go in this spot. So me, of course, I always want a pool. Whoops. <laughs> I might have wanted to get out of the water before I spawned it in. So now that green spot is a pool. I could do just to have a trampoline spawn in and then the, we could all just kind of bounce around in the backyard. I could do a tennis court. I could do a basketball court and even just have a pretty little garden. My favorite, of course, is the pool. That is what my choice is in all of my houses. So I think it looks perfect back here too. And I love the stairs into the water. Very, very cool. Anyway, so I just wanted to let you guys know that. I meant to tell you guys about that in my party video, but uh, it totally slipped my mind, so I didn't want to miss out on it again. Oh, wait, let me go in through the front door. I'm like, I'm just like cutting through the house. It's a good thing I own this house. Okay, here's the house. We just explored the backyard. Let's go in. Oh, we have an Amazon delivery already. That must be my housewarming gift. They know I spend a lot of money there, so they want to give me something to, to get me welcomed into my house. Oh, look, we have spaghetti, pizza. It is perfect timing for a house party. Oh my gosh, I really like this kitchen. But wait, the oven might be a little tall for me. <laughs> I need a step stool. And there's the water. I always love that there's water on the counters. I love this table and chair setup and look at the views, like windows for days. So yay, and I can sit there and look out at the pool. Let's go over here. Oh, this is like the lounge area. Oh yes, 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 I love this. Look at that TV, it's huge. Oh my gosh, so cute. Okay, let's turn on the fireplace. <laughs> oh, and a pool table, what's in here? Oh, a bathroom. Oh, here we go. Heather sitting on the toilet in all of our videos. I don't know what is up with me and toilets. Anyway. Uh, <laughs> sorry, guys. Sorry. I have potty humor. Is that okay? It's fine. It's fine. Da -dun -dun. But All right. So I'm not sure if this stool thing is supposed to be floating in the air like that, but it does give me a really good view out the window at the mountains, so I'm not gonna complain. Let's go explore. Oh my gosh, this room is huge. Oh, oh, look at this. I love this little patio area. Oh my gosh, so pretty. 
There's my beautiful driveway. Wish I could sit on these couches. You know, I'm totally into vibe poses and I've been making my own and I'm like obsessed now. Any game I go into that doesn't have poses where they could, I'm like, please put poses in. Please, I just love them so much. Anyway, <laughs> I do love this though. Oh wait, this bedroom has no windows. So what they did is they put this artwork here. So it feels like you're in the tropics. I kind of like that. There's a name for it and I can't remember. It's like a French name for when you use a photo as a window. Oh, gosh, I can't remember what it's called. Two cribs. Two cribs. Remember the last house we looked at, the brick house? It had two high chairs. I didn't notice high chairs in here. Wait, oh, I walked right by them. Two high chairs. Oh my gosh. Does that mean anything? Am I supposed to have two children? I just, I'm dying to find out. Am I supposed to have two kids? Am I having twins? Oh, here we go with the toilets again. Sorry guys. Uh, <laughs> Anyway, I love this house. It's really, really pretty and I, I'm dying for these lots. Like, I think this might be the only place I place my house except the beach lots going forward because, you know, I am a beach girl. But I also like the exclusivity of up here and I love, 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 love the driveway. It is so pretty and so elegant. And I really just love the updates that Seaboard City has been getting. The one thing I have to say, if you didn't see my last video, oh my gosh, hashtag Heather can't drive, turn the car, oof. Okay, so what I was saying is, if you haven't seen my last Seaboard City video, I definitely recommend checking it out because one of the things I really love about Seaboard City is their party system. It is probably one of the coolest party systems that I've seen in one of these role play games. If you guys know of others that have cool party systems, let me know in the comments. But I really, really love it. It's really making Seaboard City stand out for me as a very original kind of role play game because if you're driving around town and stuff, it does feel very similar to a lot of the other games that are out right now. I just believe with the party system, just kind of steps it up just a bit for me. Uh, there's one more thing I wanted to show you guys before I wrap up this video, and that is here at the makeup store. So come on in, check it out. So in the makeup store, you actually can do your makeup. It's pretty cool. You can see over here, there are various faces. You can choose these various faces, which is really cool, and you can just put them right on, but Beware, it is a 99 Robux game pass. So you will have to buy that in order to equip the faces. But if you have it, this is a really fun thing. You can come in and get your makeup done. I mean, come on now. Very, very cool. Anyway, you guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I will be back with more Seaboard City. They have been, okay, here's the tea. They have been teasing some new features coming this week that are supposed to be a major update. As a matter of fact, while I was filming this video, they posted a tweet and it says, we've got a huge Seaboard City announcement coming out tomorrow. Stay tuned to hear what we've got coming to the game. I can't wait. And you guys know I'll be covering the update as soon as it's out. If you enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up. Let me know you watched. And of course, if you'd like to see more of any of my content, including Seaboard City, make sure you smash that subscribe button if you haven't already. And then ring the bell so you get notified when I post something new on the channel. And there's lots more coming. Until next time, guys. Bye.